Today, 10 contestants will go head to head against each other to win 10 million gil. The four games that they will be competing in are the underwater race, the mount off, a glam contest, and finally, a riddle. Let's see who wins the 10 million gil games. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And it begins. And it begins. The people are off. They are on the bikes. They are making their way. Come on. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Who's out in first? Let's get an update on who is out in front. We got Jad. Jad's in second at the moment. Is that Ash out in front? I see. They're making their way to the B objective. Remember that B objective, people. Don't forget about that. Use the waypoints if you need. We got a strong point going out. Make sure. Stay near the ground. I like it. I like it. I like it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I can't see. <laughs> no, Stort. Come on, Stort. We got to keep an eye on the contestants. Got to make sure that they're popping in the church. We do have judges in there as well to make sure that people are popping the things that they need. Ash is out in front. You see that? All right, let's continue. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And then in second place here, we got Hamai there as well. That's close, it's close, it's close. Oh, Bird going into fourth as well. Make sure you go around, make sure you go around. Okay, we got a penalty deduction on Amber and also Reed as well. Now we're going out into the final leg. And they're out, they're out, they're out. Make sure to go through the pillars. First, second, in. Nice, nice, nice. Here they come, here they come. Jad. Amber. Silver, there we are. And the results are in for the first round. In 10th place, we have King with one point. In 9th place, we have O'Shea with two points. In 8th place, we have Nightwind with three points. In 7th place, we have Amber with four points. In sixth place, we have Jad with five points. In fifth place, we have Hanami with six points. In fourth place, we have Wampus with seven points. In third place, we have Reen with eight points. And in second place, we have Estelle with nine points. And in first place, we have Sake with ten points. And now let's make our way to game two, the Mount Off. The second game that we are going to be doing is paying homage to the king himself, Asmund Gold. We are going to be doing a mount off. I'm going to be getting on 15 different mounts. If you have that mount, then please do get on that mount. If you do not have that mount, it doesn't matter. You'll just lose a point. Are we ready? The first mount, obviously. You're part of the FC. So you've got to have a chocobo, a fat chocobo. Jad does not have the fat chocobo. We have Jad with the War Panther. So every other contestant does not have the War Panther. Oh, maybe? No, no. Okay, just Jad with that one. Let's go. Okay, okay. I've chose some hard ones. Gabriel. Does anyone have the Gabriel mount? Join me if you do. Oh, okay. Reen has the Gabriel mount. Let's go. Amber does have it as well. Jad has got the Gabriel mount as well. Oh, oh, okay. Got quite a few. Wampus has it also. Who has the flying chair? I got a, What? Reen, holy damn. Also, Amber as well with the chair. Bell with the chair as well. Let's go. Oh, let's go. We all know about the, uh, the story that we went through, the emotional story. Does everyone have the one-eyed man? Oh, okay. Amber's got it. Sylvia. Oh, I feel... Oh, Reen's got it as well. Hell yeah, let's go. Take's got it also. Ham I. Oh, feels like we got a full party going on here today, huh? Hey, get that Amaro out of here. <laughs> Wampus does not have the bed, so one of the contestants do have the bed. Now, we've all played through a Realm Reborn. We've all had a good time. But did you farm up the mounts for a Realm Reborn? Do you have Nightmare? The Nightmare mount, a rare mount that you do get. Oh, oh, speaking of rare, we are on that. Oh, all right, okay, okay. Two out of the contestants do not. Now, we all love a little bit of Final Fantasy 15, don't we? Was you in the event that happened for that? If so, come join me on the convoy. It's a four-seat amount of... <laughs> oh, yeah. We got a full house. And the final mount for the mount off. We love him. He's a massive part of the story. 
Midgardsum. And there we go. That concludes the second game of the 10 million guild games. Look at that. <laughs> All the dragons. Holy damn. The points are in for the second round. In 10th place, we have King with 5 points. In 9th place, we have Oshir with 12 points. In 8th place, we have Nightwind with 13 points. Tied at 17 points are Hamai and Amber. In 5th place, we have Jad with 19 points. 4th place, we have Estelle with 21 points. 3rd place, we have Sake with 22 points. 2nd place is Wampus with 23 points. And in 1st, we have Reen with 24 points. Now onto the glam contest where there's no theme and there's one glam per person. Sake up first. Beautiful combination. I'm really liking this. Reminds me of like Horizon Zero Dawn. Giving me that kind of aesthetic going on there. I really like the glam and the combination there. And also the hair color as well. I'm really liking that in combination. Four from Alps, a four from me. And from the other three judges, a three, a four, and a three. Extremely high. Good. Next, we move to Reen. Really liking the glam and everything you got going on here as well. Really matches like the Yilmore kind of style going on. The combination of the glasses as well, and also the earring that you've got up top as well. I really do like that. Adding a little bit of color to the attire as well. Do you have any weapon or anything like that? If you could give us a little swirl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, okay. Okay. Looking smart, but also pretty deadly at the same time. I'm going to have to give that a four. For Rain's first glam, Albs gave a four, and I gave a two. Now, my reasoning is mostly job gear, but I do see a die and I see a glam on the weapon. Oh, okay. Now, we also have a three, a four, and a two for a total of 15. Let's move on to O'Shea, shall we? We're in a strip club, and you've got a uh, private mask on as well. I like that you'll fit into the uh, the location that we are in as well. You can give us a little show on that. Oh, oh, you've also dyed them as well, I see. Matching them with the outfit that you have on the attire. I really like the, what is that, a golden sort of brown that you've got going on there as well. That is really, really nice. All right, so the judges' scores from Alps, a three from myself. Uh, I looked a little uncoordinated. I'm giving it a one, but okay. the other judges gave a two, a three, and a two for a total of 11. Okay. Oh, got the man. Hold on. That's like the, that's the Mandeville outfit, isn't it? And then you, I got the wine or the champagne as well. Okay. I'm really liking this glam. The fact that you've used the top. Oh, there you go. Has a little thing as well. So the fact that you've used the top of the Mandeville outfit as well. And then you've also added the glam pieces as well to work with the rose. Eh? <laughs> with the rose and then the offset with the red with the earrings and the bow on the top. I really like this. And then you've broken it up as well with the red on the high leggings. Or like the high boot. Okay, so four from Alistair's, four from me, and the other three judges. Four, three, and two for a total of 17. Now we move on to Sylvia's. I'm loving Sylvia's glam. It gives me that kind of like Pirates of the Caribbean vibes. Ooh, okay. I really like how you've gone. Is that with the, is that like a greeny kind of red? I like that because you've broken up the outfit with this green. And you have multiple different colors of green going on here. And also... I don't know if you've done it with the red. That actually matches the red in the hat as well. I like that because you're breaking up the colors. And it really, oh, it really offsets like the glam with that red. And it reminds you of like the evil trees and stuff you would get. I'm not saying that they're a tree, but you know what I mean. With that, that evil kind of look, that horror kind of look. From Alpsters and I, a four and a four, and the other three judges, a four, a three, and a three for a total Ooh. of 18. King Penguin. Oh, hello. Did you just come out of the showers that are just out the down the road from Yilmore? We've been in there quite a couple of times for the MSQ. I'm liking the look as well. Ooh. With the blue offset with the glasses as well. I'm liking it. Oh, the sage glass as well. Okay, that's kind of cool. I like that. I really do like that. With the combination with the hair color as well, and also with the sage. And kind of like... It's the casual kind of glam. I like it. 
Okay, we've got a two from Alpsters, a three from me, and a one and a one and a one. <laughs> so a total of eight. <laughs> Okie dokie. We move into Jad next up. Ooh. Going with that Garlean kind of vibe. That's what it's kind of giving me as well. Ready for war. Ooh, trying to shoot the judges. What's going on? <laughs> I am liking the weapon as well. And the fact that your weapon also complements your headpiece as well. With the black and blue going on. I really like that. The whole attire really works to get... Ooh, watch out for the bullets coming in. Ooh. And also with the earring as well. Giving that offset of blue again. I really do like this glam. It works. Like, Sid Garlon would definitely hire you. Like, holy damn. I like this a lot. I... I really do. Oh, that's a machinist. What are you talking about? What? There's oh, a book on the side. <laughs> <laughs> that's the machinist <laughs> thing. <laughs> looks like He's a got a gun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, someone could have picked it up. Uh, the scores for Jad are a four from you and a three from me, and a four and a three and a two from the judges, which is a total of 16. Wombus, hello. Have you been with Sir Emmerich by any chance? I love the attire that you got going on. This is very Witch King. That uh, is. Holy do <laughs> The combination of the gold and black weapons that you're going on as well, and with the helmet. The hot pink tail. <laughs> Oh, did they really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Got the tail going on as well. Hell yeah. This is so badass, though. Four from you, mm -hmm. a three from me. Now, I'm going to point out some color coordination here. I okay. see that the boots and the greaves are red, but there's something going on where some of these are undyable. So it looks... It's very, very good, but I can't oh. give it perfect. That's all. Okay, okay. <laughs> and uh, the rest of the judges are a four and a three and a three. Ooh. And that total is 17. The next person that we do have up is Amber. And let's have a little look, shall we? Go in with that summoner kind of vibe as well. I didn't even know you could get these leggings as well. Look at, the oh, Stort, get out of the way, Stort. I like this. A very cutesy kind of vibe as well with the flowers in the hair as well. I ooh, kind of giving it that Egyptian kind of look as well. Amber, do you have oh, you do have a weapon as well. Really going with that whole uh, like thing that you're going with that mage kind of vibe. I like that. Uh, the bottoms are starlight tights, and the shoes are the Thafnarian sandals. Every single piece was carefully selected by Amber for this. Okay. I love that. Can I up my score to a four? <laughs> sure. <laughs> well, now getting the additional intel and stuff that I'm not knowledgeable with, I want to bump sure. that up to a four. Okay, so Amber got a four from you and a four from me. And from the other judges, a three, a four, and a two. And the total Ooh. is... That's 17. Anami is up now. Ho 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 hopefully pronounce that correctly. Here we are. Let's have a little look at the glam. Oh. Going with the 80s look, isn't that correct, chat? Yeah, I think with the 80s yeah. look, with the flare trousers going on, or what they call it in America, pants. Call it pants. Pants, man. And I like... <laughs> the co oh, what? That is really, really nice. The offset as well with the white and the red. I really like it. But that... That weapon. Cool. That is nice. And also with the red... Or like the pink on the end of the weapon to really contrast and go with your hair as well. I really like that. And the choker, I see there. Given that element of green off the weapon as well. The weapon really adds to this piece. I really, really do like this. And the totals are three from Alpsters, three from me, and the other three judges are three and two and four. So average to threes across the board, which is a score of 15. They were some incredible glams. And the results are now in for the points for that round. So in 10th place, we have King with 15 points. In 9th place, we have Oshir with 24 points. In 8th place, we have Nightwind with 32 points. Hamai with 32 points as well. Amber with 34 points in 6th place. In 5th place, we have Jad with 35 Joint free 
is Estelle, Sake, and Wampus with 40 points. And in first place is Reen. The next game up is a riddle in the pinned comment. You will see the riddle that the contestants had to listen to. And go find three different locations to then get to the final location. The judges were in place at their three locations. Mordonna, Limsa, Leminza, and Corpus Highland. And the final location being Ishgard, the last vigil. Let's see how the contestants got on with the riddle. There's Lana. Hey, hey, hey. And this should give help to some of the contestants that are... Maybe uh, struggling with the riddles as well. Uh, this may or may not be <laughs> one of the locations. Uh, no, uh, it might be. I don't know. Uh, Lana just happens to be standing here. Oh, we've got Hamai. Hamai is in. Grabbing one of the items. Let's go. Hell yeah. And the contestant is off making their way downstairs, maybe. Oh, we have Vale here as well. Let's go. The contestants are rolling it. We have a winner already. Uh, she, 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 she came in real fast. Who, 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 who? Uh, it is Sake Maki, first to finish. Ooh. Okay. We've got some people that are struggling with the um, location for one of these uh riddles oh 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 we've got another one coming in right now oh okay okay i've got jag coming in to get another riddle i've come to one of the locations to help out the uh some of the contestants that's why i've come to one of the locations to help them out with the last few contestants struggling i made my way to the final location to await their arrival is she a lullaby oh no no there she is there she is there she is oh, oh my god oh. <laughs> is she lagging <laughs> no she does this thing. No. <laughs> She's doing a slow-mo finish. She's like, can I make it? <laughs> Getting the slow-mo finish in. Is there any other contestants that's going to get behind her? Come on, teleport in. Teleport. Oh, oh, oh. No, oh, no, no. Just hit her. No. <laughs> oh, Reaper no. jump. <laughs> no. There it is. Jad has finished. No. Is that Costa? No, no, she's still got to turn in. She's still got to turn in. There it is. It there it is. <laughs> got tired on the way. Congratulations to Wampus. First place with the six million gil. Woo! The three winners were Wampus, Saki, and Jad. They are walking away with over a million gil. Oh, it feels good. Can't what you have now. Don't count what you do.